Minister. Prime Minister Boris Johnson wants to restart trade talks with China that have been suspended for several years. That's according to the political website, which says the PM has personally tasked the Department for International Trade with arranging high-level talks with China for the first time since 2018. The decision risks upsetting Tory MPs, some of whom are already sanctioned by Beijing for calling out human rights abuses. Former Tory leader Ian Duncan Smith urged the government to think again. He told Politico, I will not let it rest if we start now. Amid all the evidence of genocide, brutality, crackdowns on peaceful protesters, and go traipsing along there as though nothing happened. Government officials are reported to be focused on reviving the UK-China Joint Economic and Trade Committee meeting this year. The meeting was held annually until 2018 when relations between Britain and China deteriorated over Hong Kong. Politico also reports that Chancellor Rishi Sunak asked Treasury officials to bring back the UK-China Economic and Financial Dialogue last held in 2019. Chair of the Commons Foreign Affairs Committee, Tom Tugendhat, says the timing of the decision is surprising. He told Politico the UK needs to make up its mind whether it wants a stronger economic relationship with China or whether it wants a new China strategy, which reflects the challenge of trade coercion and human rights abuses. Both Duncan Smith and Tugendhat are among the seven parliamentarians sanctioned by the Chinese regime. Last year, the House of Commons declared that genocide is taking place against Uyghurs and others in China. The motion is not legally bound, but it is a sign of growing discontent among MPs towards the Chinese Communist Party.